Why is GPG list key sometimes printing subkeys, sometimes not? This question occurred in the comments of how do I display the usage flags for my encryption keys in a less hackish way. And seems worth being answered in a Q&A, a form as the answer is not actually obvious. To view Torvald's open key 449 FA3 app, I use GPG2 list keys 449 FA3 app, which outputs. Usually, this command also lists subkeys, but no subkeys are printed for Torvald's key. Yet, when requesting batch output, there is one included. Seems like this Torvalds key has some special feature that hides the subkey. What happened here? Expired keys. This is no special feature, but Torvalds primary key is expired quite some time ago, and in consequence also the subkey. The answer is hidden in Noob's list options section of the man pages, as by default expired subkeys are hidden. From man GPG2. By specifying this argument, the subkey will show up. Traveling back in time. You can also verify this using the helpful fake time program to set the system time back some years for Noop. By traveling back in time to some date where Torvald's key was valid, the sub key will show up again. <laughs>